Hi everyone, 我是 Jack. 大家好，我是卡拉。欢迎收听今天的早安英文。Okay, so today we're like going to be talking about filler words, you know? Oh yeah, that sounds like pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so me and Kara just used about three three filler words each just then. And today we're going to be talking to you all about why we use them and what they are for. 对，就这个 filler 这个词呢，它的本意是填装物、填塞物，因为我们知道 fill 是填充的意思嘛，然后加上一个 e r， 就是填用来填充的东西。所以呢，当你在聊天的间隙啊，突然间忘词，或者说词穷，或者需要思考的时候呢，用来填补这段时间的这个填充的词和句子，我们就可以叫做 filler words。那用来避免那个尴尬的沉默啊，可想而知它有多重要。Okay, let's get started by quickly talking about some Chinese filler words. Uh, can you give me some examples, Kara? 可以的，呃，比如说啊，呃，这个的话，这个的话，让我想一下。哎呦，我要说啥来着？等等等等。啊，等等等等，对。Okay, so a filler word is a word or phrase that has no real meaning. It just gives the speaker a chance to pause during their conversation. 对 ，as I just said, these are very useful because they give us time. Uh, to think exactly, so we know what we want to say next. Yeah, that's right.、Uh, they are useful because they can help you sound more like a native speaker. It just helps making your language sound more natural and relaxed. 嗯，就是如果说你直接就 pause and think and keep silence during the conversation <laughs>、right. 的话，那人家可能就会觉得说，嗯。What's wrong? <laughs> 就会就会尴尬啊。Yeah, it's important to remember that we can only use filler words when we are talking. They aren't generally required for written English unless maybe you're writing what somebody said. 对，那可能在 WeChat texting 的时候也会用，对不对？嗯，是的。就总之呢，在口语的情况下使用，如果说是在正式的书写文体当中，就要尽量避免啦。Okay, right. Let's have a look at an example. Okay. Um, I don't get it. <laughs> After the teacher gives you some work. Um, just should like uh. Ah, uh. uh、mm, 对，就比如说老师交代下来一件事情，或者说人家讲了一个什么话，你没有听明白，你就可以说 ，Um, I don't get it. Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> this is very popular for 小朋友 I know this. Yeah, kids love to say um. Uh, Chinese also very good translation. It means I didn't get it. Oh right, I understand. Okay, right. Let's have a look at some more. Okay, so I think um is a very common one,、mm. and this is used to stop an awkward silence. 对，如果说呃这个词的拼写啊，如果说大家在微信聊天的时候要使用的话，它拼写是 U M M. 当然，你可以打很多很多的 M. Yeah. So another example would be like if you were asked a question. So somebody said, "Do you know where my friend went?" And you would say, "Um, um. <laughs> <laughs> I think he went to the shop." 对，就是呃，这个就是给大家刚刚讲这个 U M M 啊，这是第一个。Okay, 下一个。好。Okay. So next we have like L I K E. This is more often used in the middle of a sentence. For example, do you know how to get there? Yeah, I'm like pretty sure that it's on like this way. <laughs> you used to there. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, my dad used to tell me off for using like too much as a filler word. So be careful not to overuse it. 好的，那 like 这个词呢，在这里其实它就是没有实际含义的， mm. 就是一个用来给你思考的缓冲的这么一个词。Okay, so next we have a filler word that can be used to make your sentence stronger. So it's actually, actually. a you should that a c t u a l l y. Hmm. So instead of saying I think dogs are really cute, you should say, actually, I think dogs are really cute. 感觉像在唱双簧啊！但是还是要提醒一下大家啊 ，Don't overuse this word、mm. because I've noticed many Chinese people do. Yes, it is a good one, but be careful not to overkill. 对，嗯、mm. 
那 another one we can use to make our sentence stronger is at the end of the day, 是吧？是的。So instead of saying he's a great friend, you would say at the end of the day he's a great friend. This is actually a phrase that doesn't mean what you think it means, 是吧？就 at the end of the day， 它的确呢是可以表示说在一天的最末尾，但是呢，在这种情况下，它表示的意思是。Yeah, so this phrase basically means that you have to say something or you have to do something. It doesn't mean uh one shang, like does not mean evening. 对对对，在这里呢，它的意思就是最终到头来，或者说归根结底。At the end of the day, you've got to speak up for yourself. 对。Okay, another way to use fillers is to include the listener in the conversation without ending your sentence. 听起来很神奇的样子。<laughs> Here we go. <laughs> A conversation takes at least two people, so by using these, you are trying to keep their attention. Yes. So the most common one to use in this instance is "you know." This is another one I used to get in a lot of trouble for because I said it every day. <laughs> did your dad tell you off again? He did. He did. Yeah. <laughs>、uh, you know. Now we look at this. You know. So you can give us an. Ex- can you give us an example sentence with "you know," please? He was really funny. You know. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, just exactly what what the what the Baba would say. <laughs> 对，然后如果有人经常就很烦人，总是讲 you know， 那我就会开玩笑说 I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 对了 ，I noticed you've been using one filler sentence a lot. Oh really? Guess what it is. Oh, 我不知道。猜一下，想一下。是吗？呃，告诉告诉我，告诉我，我不知道。你经常说 ，Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's you know what I mean. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Just words. 他经常给我解释东西的时候就会说 ，Do you know what I mean? <laughs> 你知道我什么意思吗？啊，当然也不会真的等我的回答了。<laughs> 好，这、okay. 是他的一个口头禅。<laughs> <laughs> right. Finally, we have、um, just noises. I think it's like, right. Hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. They're just. All of these are just used to passively agree to what somebody's talking about. 就是感觉说 Yes, I'm listening. 嗯，是啊，对对对对，我有在听哦。对。So, for example,、uh, if I was talking about this movie that I saw last night. I would say, "Hey, Cara, this movie was really good. It had、mm-hmm. lots of great actors, and、uh, oh, the the lighting、yeah. was awesome." Yeah, and da 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 da. 就给一个回应啊，一方面呢表示说我有在听，一方面呢表示我是赞同的，就是不要让对方一个人单独的在讲话，你要。就是 get involved in this conversation. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区。领取哦，你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。Okay, that's all we have for you today. But thank you very much for listening. 我是 Jack， 我是卡拉，再见，拜拜，拜。